is Subong Chang. Uh, I'm study I'm student in Hailin University. <coughs> so um, today my topic is social uh, social method for protecting against watering hole attacks. Uh, before start, I want to I want to tell you uh, um, please understand me because I'm not good at English. I, but I think I can uh, communicate with you. Uh, introduction. Um, these days, many people use the internet and they, people access the many servers. But it, uh, even if uh, we request a sp specific domain address, we will uh, receive another uh, URL together, not only uh, the domain which I want and hackers use hackers are uh, e exploiting this vulnerability to plant malicious code in the data uh, being re re replied and the user continues to continues to use it without knowing the infection so um, Nowadays, many people uh, don't don't receive any files because of virus or malicious code. So we we wor nowadays we worried about that. So we don't receive any files. But um, the especially malicious URLs are really difficult to uh, distinguish before we connect, and. Uh, they don't know, we don't know uh, when and where they will be updated. So uh, I want to tell about that uh, this attack is like putting poison into a watering hole in Savannah ca causing uh, disease to uh, all the animal that drink it. Uh, this is a uh, Korea, Korean company, um, name is Susan INT. Uh, they uh, they found new malicious URL newly discovered each month. So this is uh, last year, the first half of 2017. Uh, they found total 93,000 mal new malicious URL. So um, this is uh, how the hackers use the method. If we re request I and the many other URL came together, so we can see only the I, but uh, we we there are many other URL, other data has come to my device. <coughs> so we don't know how many device, uh, how many URLs come. So this is uh, Korea some news page name is insights.com. And then I installed the U matrix, which is block advertisement or mal malicious URL. So the U matrix uh, tell me when I enter this insights.com, but I got four, 49 URLs. I got 49 URLs that may contain malware or ads. So we don't know uh, if we, we want to see something, but there are many things come to my device and then we cannot distinguish which is not good, which is good. So these days, um, there are Pi whore. Um, people use Raspberry Pi and install Pi, some program. Then uh, Pi whore connect with the uh, access points. Then uh, we used uh, block advertisement or malicious URL. So Raspberry Pi uh, is a tiny computer developed for educational purpose. So, we, but this is have a, this is similar with our desktop. So we can use many things. Also, we can make we can build ma a, almost everything. Not I'm sorry, not almost, but many things. And Pi Hole, uh, people uh, some people installed in the Pi Hole, and then. Uh, create a DNS server layer to reject the request of blank list. And so it can block advertisement and mal mal malware. So this is the method. 
the normal browser blocker uh, it is like this. So my, my computer sends requests something from server, and the server responds to my d computer. Then my browser block. So it, the data is come already come to my device. So browser blocker block it at browser level. So the as malware already accessed uh, my computer. But this is PyHole. Um, when, my, when my device request uh, something from server, and the as and malware blocked on the DNS layer, and then the response, like some data we want come to my device. So since the ads are prevent, prevent at the network level and before the ads reaches my device, we can, we can prevent ads or malware from appearing on internet connected device that aren't a web browser. Uh, so I, I, uh, I used this, and then I wanted to use this, uh, make a, I really want to make a good cyberspace environment. Uh, actually, my, if, I, if my grandmother or grandfather buy a new device, like computer or phone, they, just, they will just use, and they, they can get many bad thing in their device, but um, if we set up this in our home network or company network, they just use the, the net, when, they when they just use the network, they cannot get this malicious URL or as some bad thing. And the Pyre is ba uh, use blank list, already people uh, find and the analysis and then that is not good and then they uh, made blank list. Using, bl using the blank list, the pyre blocked uh, the URLs. So uh, how can you collect blank list? They, uh, people already uh, uh, make blank list. They um, use crawler or some report and then make a blank list and then they share it. But I think I think uh, we, we need more powerful things. So I think social power is more powerful. So uh, this idea is from Korean police webpage. Uh, Korean police have service uh, to checking phone number or bank account number uh, to show the numbers that have been reported to the police more than three times at the last three months. So if we, uh, if we want to deal with someone, but we don't know who is this, but we can, we can check the number and bank account, and then now uh, before we deal, we can uh, re reduce the da damage by police registering the phone number and account to use the, for the phishing. So uh, this idea, uh, I want to use this idea to hold the s cyberspace. So every country people use different language and they uh, use really different websites. Depends on country, area, field, or job. So I usually go to neighbor and the, some other website. Um, and the website is Korean language. Uh, but the other site, like Japan or Arab, I can, I can access. But if we change the um, job or the country, site, uh, area, field, you learn language, we can visit. And then, but we don't have information from there, so we can get some malicious URL or some phishing site, yeah. So I think the power of sharing, uh, I think the sharing is, is more powerful. So uh, this is benefit. 
So we, we share information about the site. We don't, uh, we don't, we don't use often. So I, the information mean is malware, mal malware and phishing sites or ads. And, si and next is, since it is done automatically, not much effort is required. And third, it is more powerful than a crawler. Uh, I th uh, before I think about this model, I thought the crawler is, I, I wanted to use crawler, but crawler cannot find, we can find, and, but uh, crawler take a lot of time. But if, we, if each people, each country people use, uh, make blacklist and then we can, if we share, um, that is more powerful and we can read it many times. So this is a uh, model what I think. Uh, first, go to website and second, download the old DNS list. Then we delete, duplicate because we visit the same site a lot. And four, uh, check the list with vir virus total. This I, I will tell, I will explain again. And five, good list to go to white list for one, for uh, one month. And six, bad list to go to blank list forever. And seven, up, upload blank list to GitHub. And eight, Pyre automatically download the blank list. So the first, uh, to go to website. So we just visit the website as a user. We just use use it the website, and then um, like U metrics, I I just use I just use U metrics, but there are many uh, ad broker or um, malicious broker, and then the broker show me the me how many uh, URL come. So if we uh, when we download the list. We can delete the du duplicate uh, list. Then we send the list and we send it to uh, some free, free checking, free checking, webs free checking malicious or virus website. Like there are many free sites uh, that check for URLs that contain virus or malicious ma malware, and check the generated list using the API of the site. So using the a API, we can uh, automatically check. And then if we, this is good, go to white list. This is bad, go to blank list. So after checking, yeah. And then uh, white list is for one month because websites can be updated at any time. Then seven, uh, update the blacklist to GitHub. We need to share, so uh, we need to put, we need to put uh, GitHub and we can share, then we made the repository and the Pyre automatically download. Pyre has a function to download the blacklist, so we, we can, uh, we can choose which blacklist we can, uh, I want to use. So this model, if that is, if this model is, automatically like if I programming this and then made a plugin install uh, to Chrome um, and that it will be reduce effort reduce time and if we put function like a phishing site li reports if I if I think there is a phishing site I can just put like click and then directly go to uh, blank list and that is really good information to everyone. But the problem is uh, the sites uh, have API. The API uh, to check for mal malware and virus has limited capabilities because one API can, like their API have limit, limit capabilities. So it will take uh, more time so we can we can reduce the list to check by using the open list. But however, amount of list we produce per day is quite large, large, large. And so there is a limit to, to API capabilities. And be, um, and then be, uh, GitHub is publicly available, so someone uh, can in 
intentionally put unnecessary lists uh, in the way of blank list functionality. So if somebody think really bad way and he put um, any domain, then the blank list is not useful. So, so I I really uh, I think uh, I, I don't know. Um, do we have to distinguish who who it, who is using it or not? I need to think about more. So, uh, conclusion: in the in cyberspace, it can be a pow powerful force for many p people to share malware malware bi viruses and phishing information. Um, and then the Pyor uh, can block and network level. So my father, my grandmother, grandfather, grandfather, yeah, they we can protect them or we can protect, we can help them, um, help friends or coworker or who, someone who don't, who we don't know, but we can help. We can make, I think we can make a good environment in cyberspace and. This model, I think this model will reduce people's efforts to improve cyberspace. Thank you. Let's make a good cyberspace. <laughs>